hello hello today we're going to talk about the warrior changes uh, i'm going to talk about a lot of more things later on in the week but for now i figured i'd focus on the class that i'm the most familiar with then that's the warrior so i've had some time to mess around and kind of check out the changes and sort of just experiment and see the nerfs the buffs uh so on and so forth right now since i'm on console well i mean i'm always console but like i'm on console so the problem is we haven't gotten the full changes of like everything yet so there's going to be a lot more changes to come there's going to be different uh you know variations of things like the grave digging change where it's going to be a a knockdown instead of a bound that's going to be huge uh solar flare is going to have a natural so like just super armor on it uh, balance strike is going to have a super armor core instead of a forward guard there's there's a lot coming soon but for now i'm just going to talk about what we have and what we lost so the biggest issue that i saw is that we lost our cancels so no more block cancel overwhelm reckless or anything like that you can't you, you can't do any of that. that that's not uh that's not something we can do anymore so if we if we try block cancel and then reckless it will no longer do the you know speed cancel where you can go into that the same thing applies for if you were to go into block cancel into slashing same thing with grave digging we lost all of that shit it's so sad we're so fucking doomed now i've heard a myriad of things people have told me that it's just a current like bug at the moment and that it's going to possibly come back at like a later time i don't believe so i don't think it's coming back ever i think uh it's too complicated for them to figure out why it happened or like whatever the block changes or not the block changes but the hit changes that happened probably messed it up and i gotta be honest i have no faith in pearl abyss to even try and figure out that issue if they happen to figure it out and it is true that it is a bug and and they will fix it in the future absolutely amazing and i will be really happy but i am going to continue to play the game in the aspect of we lost them permanently and there's going to be no no chance of redemption that we're going to get those back at all so that's just how i'm going to assume i just don't have faith in them to fix it so it is what it is right honestly just thinking about it i'm having an existential crisis so I'm, I'm melting inside right now anyway look okay one of the biggest things is is the canceling like i know every warrior that was super adept in cancels and understood how to do them and how to perform them it, it was just it, it's a big blow it is a big blow because that is how we would get a lot of our damage out there so on top of the reason why the cancels are big it's like overwhelm for example gives us down attack plus 10 percent that's really really big like i need you guys to understand how big that is that that's a massive thing so every time we would get like a grab cc right you know we would do our full like you know combo like this and then we would block cancel overwhelm grave digging slashing the whole you know just adding extra damage right because warrior is a combo class that that is like how we kill people we're not a burst dps class we, we don't just dive into a ball and just kill 17 people we don't have that um capability it's not it's not physically possible right like it's just not something that the class performs so we needed combos in order to do that and how warrior players would optimize combos is being able to fit in skills like overwhelm merciless things like that would generally result in getting kills because we were pumping damage and merciless is another thing that i'm going to talk about in a moment but merciless was a big one too because we got crit damage off of this as well so what we would do is we would incorporate overwhelm we would incorporate merciless into our combos so that way we could you know maximize our damage since we don't have a lot of burst dps and we used a lot of our bsrs too which is like you know uh, bsr pulverized that was another big one that we utilized because again we don't have burst dps and eventually that's going to get nerfed too i did see the patch notes that i read the other day which was just like yeah we're, we're gonna we're gonna lose a little bit of damage on pulv so that's going to be super obnoxious now for those of you wondering well since we lost block canceling or to just you know at the moment we don't really have it uh what can we do what is the optimal like like what exactly are we going to do to kind of like get around this well the most important thing is is understanding combo still you're going to be able to still fit things in there it's just not going to be as airtight and fast as it used to be so you're still going to have to you know just kind of fit stuff in there right so like if you go for the regular bread and butter right boom and then you go into this bam 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 
spam but you you, you can still do combos like it, it's not the end of the world yes it is really really obnoxious and you can't do things in a super fast manner like we did before but we can still do it, it it's just not as efficient it's not as effective and you can't get too risky with it either you're not going to be doing stuff like you know bop 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 and you, it, like it's not gonna you're not gonna do stuff like that like i used to do combos like that all the time where i would go in and i would like you know grab and then i would do something like boom 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 and then i would go into like all kinds of like different you know combos about like that you, you know i would try you know balance strike solar flare into a ton of different things and it, it's just like you can still do them it's just complicated and it's not as it's not as airtight so you're just gonna have to experiment with your potential one of the things that i think that a lot of people are sleeping on is you can actually still do the merciless cancel so you do merciless block cancel into overwhelm or not overwhelms i'm sorry you do merciless block cancel into grave digging or slashing both of those work all the time you can do that whenever you want so you do merciless block cancel and then grave digging you see the cancel still works it's not it's again it's not as fast as overwhelm but the cancel does work and it does speed up the animation a little bit a little bit it's not super fast but it does still work and the you're gonna need to mess with the timing it, it's like i'm not i'm not that adept in it yet I, i'm still i'm still like trying to trying to figure out how you like see the timing on it is a little wonky it's really wonky you have to kind of get used to it that's the biggest problem with merciless is that the cancel is like it's a little weird it's it's not perfect the grave digging is probably the easiest version to do where you just hit the bop and then you just go into it that's a bit easier that's easier to do so i would recommend if you're going to do combos uh overwhelm is probably not the go-to if i'm being honest with you so you could do something like uh let's say overwhelm and then you would just do like block cancel overwhelm well no overwhelm block cancel merciless you could do something like that so like that that's a pretty decent one so instead you would do like this this bam you see what i'm saying you see that you see you see how i sped how i sped up the animation and like fucking went sicko mode there like you could do something like that that is a pretty good one it's just again it's not perfect and ideal but it does work and you see you see how yeah you see there you go like you, you can you can still speed it up it's possible it's just not it, it's just not perfect i'm sorry it's just not perfect so yeah like that's the biggest thing is the cancels like we lost those like that's a that's a huge l but like we, we have some alternatives it's not the worst thing in the world it's just like you know we we have to make concessions for where we can and we have to like figure out what we can do instead and the merciless cancel will be probably the best option we have for the time being so just keep that in mind that we didn't lose everything but we did lose a lot of you know a lot of stuff with the cancels so just keep that in mind that it, you can still like you can still default like if you catch somebody right like let's say you just you know you, know, you can still do this right like like you still have plenty of time to combo out like it's again it's not the end of the world it's not the end of the world but it it, it sucks but now we just have to do like different options right so like if we want to go for like maximize combos bam bam boom 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 something like that you, you, you could like that's pushing it a little bit there if i'm being honest with you like that's that's very much pushing it because they're, they're more inclined to get up but like yeah it's it, it sucks at the end of the day as a warrior player it is our job to adapt to figure out how we can still continue to you know combo people out and be efficient in wars and be efficient in fighting in general and that's just part of the game and right now they're shifting the meta they're doing a lot of weird stuff i'm going to talk about the meta at a different time at a later time but for now i just wanted to focus on the cancels and you know the warrior changes and whatnot some of the other things too it's like um I, I don't really know that I care too much about anything else. I think the cancels was, was the main thing. I think that's what everybody was really upset about and what like everyone is super worried uh, in terms of just being able to be effective anymore. But it doesn't mean it's not the end of the world. Now, the other thing that I want to mention, just because like we haven't gotten those changes yet, but I do want to talk about it. It's the chopping kick. We are no longer going to have a bound on this. And then the ground smash thing, we are no longer going to have a bound on that either so that's big that's a really really big one and i gotta be honest with you i think that's a shit change and the reason i think it's a shit change is it has nothing to do with like oh like i i just want to bound i just want to bound people for free i want to have an aoe cc no, no 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 you misunderstand okay 
you guys all complain to me every everybody that ever fights me always talks about yo he's just blocking and grabbing guess what i'm gonna do now even more that that's the biggest thing right is that there's no reason to take risks with skills like chopping kick right like chopping kick it's a super armor bound okay if there was a grab class that went for it right let's take take striker for example striker can easily get through that by just grabbing me out of that shit. like they have a literal fucking forward guard grab which is going to be a super armor grab because a rampaging predator so like yeah that's a big one that i don't know that that's going to be crazy and like i don't know i i feel like when it comes to grabs right and being able to just kind of get people off of that bad habit of only grabbing you need to provide other optimal opportunities in order to actually get that shit going and that's kind of the problem is that with this change all it does is literally make warriors more inclined to block and grab and that's not fun that's not fun you don't want to encourage a blocky grab play style you want to encourage players to take risks you want to encourage players to kind of go for things that are like may not be the safest play in the book but it's but the reward for it is worth even trying like for example our block canceling right it's it's risky to go for that shit. it was very risky because what would happen is you would do unprotected block protected unprotected so whenever we would go for overwhelm reckless we would have two gaps that our opponents could catch us in right now we're not going to do that we're not going to do that anymore because it, it's not effective it, like going for this and this is not good that is not a good thing to go for i'm still going to do it but like warriors that are new that are picking up the class they're not going to be inclined to try that stuff they're not going to be inclined to do any of that they're just going to you know do this walk at you and just keep like oh yeah what are you gonna do what are you gonna do what are you gonna do oh get, good good night buddy that's gonna be i want to i want to i don't want to encourage that play style i want warriors to take risks i want them to experiment with their ability to do cancels and to do things that are out of the box that might result in more flashy kills right that's the problem with bdo is that like there's not enough time or not time but there's not enough risk taking every class now is this super armor tradey like freak class with a lot of protections too many protections everything's too tanky everything's so ridiculous and it's just you have dis you have de-incentivized risk taking that's what i want back i want people to take risks and i don't like these warrior changes i don't want to be tanky i want to make that clear i do not want to be more tanky i don't need 700 dr i don't want 700 dr i want mild tankiness so like just mild tankiness and a little bit of fucking damage that's what i'm that's what i would prefer warrior is like a little bit of damage and a little bit of tankiness i want it to be a little balanced and to where i can still die and get one comboed and killed right i, I want that because then i have if i don't die then i'm not learning that is the biggest problem with people is that if they're too tanky and they don't die they just get to chimp out for free and there's no punishment there's no reward there's no there's no like clause like cause for fucking learning anything right if i never die i never learn anything I don't learn how to defend myself. I don't learn how to catch people. I don't learn how to do anything else. If you make everybody too fucking tanky, then everybody is just running around, chimping out, going bananas, and then just fucking throwing shit everywhere. And it's just, it's not, it's just a chaos, chaotic mess. And it's, there's nothing to it. That's why I think Suck Zerker is such a ridiculous class. Mind you, I play Zerker just so you know, but like, yeah, just, I think Suck Zerker is such a chimp class because it just gets to do shit for free and almost gets no punishment whatsoever and now they're turning warrior into this mega tank that doesn't have a whole lot of damage but like he's just so tanky like mind you like i'm in rbf crystals i think no no no, no i'm not i'm in like kind of a hybrid thing but like look at this if i put on full rbf crystals yeah, mind you i don't have any spec evas but that's getting changed anyway but like just as an example here in full rbf crystals i have 607 dr just from blocking just from blocking i have 607 dr that's not okay that's not cool that is, i should not be tanky and be able to you know run rbf crystals if i run rbf crystals i should be getting absolutely fucking two tapped that's the whole point of rbf crystals is that again 
high risk because you're you're more able to die at a faster rate but you do a shit ton of damage so if you catch people or get good flanks good positioning good setups you can get a lot of kills with it but that again requires you to be good and take risks and now why the fuck would i ever do that because everyone's so tanky that even if i were to run this goofy ass build it it wouldn't work anyway because some some chimp out there's got 900 dr and fucking two cadre rings on like what am i supposed to like that's not fun so i don't know i think pa's lost the vision of how to make a fun fun combat and a lot of people keep talking about yo B yo bdo's combat is so fun it's so fun it's this it's that la, 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 la. look at this it's so fun i love it no you're an animal you're an, it's not fun it's not fun you know why because i could do the sickest combo ever and do some like absolutely fucking insane nonsense and, and it, it doesn't matter because it's some guy's got 900 dr and he's not gonna die so there's no payout for any of that so who cares is that is that fun combat for you guys like is that fun fighting a guy that's unkillable and you could be infinitely better than him but like it doesn't matter because he just has so much gear and so much tankiness that like it doesn't matter how good you are you can't kill him i'm just pissed like i'm, I'm kind of pissed i don't want to be more tanky i want i want i want there to be fun combat i want there to be rewarding combat i don't i don't want to live forever i don't want people to live forever either i want people to learn how to play the game i want people to learn how to take risks i want them to learn how to try and actually play at a normal level i don't want some guy to just be like oh you know what i'm gonna just pick this class because he never dies and he can do a lot of damage that's absurd that's nonsense that that should never be anybody's fucking that should never be anybody's prerogative is picking a class because they're so tanky that, like that's like that it, again that, that, that's absurd but i don't know like we'll see when when the time comes when everything is coming through and whatnot but like for right now as it stands unfortunately it, it's it is what it is and we lost our cancels things like that there's not a lot of risk taking with warrior but we have some some things coming up hopefully that may or may not change the dynamic of the play style but for now we're kind of stuck with this and that's okay that is okay we're fine with what we got but yeah Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.